Hello, I'm Larry O'Connor with Otherworld Computing, OWC, and here today at NAMM 2020 to, to show a few of our new products. I'm going to show you our Thunder Bay 8. Now this is a, a step up from what we've had. We have a Thunder Bay 4, 4 Bay, we have a Thunder Bay 6, and now our Thunder Bay 8 allows you to have up to eight, three and a half, or two and a half inch drives in a single Thunderbolt solution. It works with Thunderbolt 3, also compared with Thunderbolt 2, and up to 128 terabytes of storage, along with data rates with spinning hard drives up to about 1500 megabytes a second, and even higher if you choose to use SSDs. But when you need maximum storage, you want to maximize you know, your Thunderbolt device count, this guy gives you huge performance and, and that storage you need, and the reliability that only comes with soft RAID, which shifts with every Thunder Bay. Soft RAID enables you to do RAID 0, RAID 1, RAID 4, RAID 5, soon RAID 6 and 6 Plus, but more important than any of that is the drive monitoring that soft RAID brings. Now, other solutions use just smart, and the problem with smart, by the time smart tells you that a drive is, has an issue, you already know something's wrong. You may not know what's wrong because you're having different potentially crashes, you know, system locks, problems that you know you need to trace down. And by the time smart typically will tell you that a drive has failed or is in need of replacement, those problems have already been present for, for longer than they should have been. Soft rate, even while the drive is still giving you normal function, even for performing, letting you do the work that you need to get done, software looks at things beyond smart to determine that a drive is moving to a state that's going to be a problem. So three to six months, even longer, before a drive fails, software comes out and says, hey, there's a drive that's, that is at this point predicted to fail you know, before it's actually failed. And that gives you the ability to move data, to replace a drive even, without any having to worry about data loss before that drive actually becomes a problem. Really, really excited about our Excelsior 4M2. This is an SSD array that plugs and plays in actually any Mac Pro from 2012 up and into and up to and including the new 2019. And the really cool thing about the 2019 uh, Mac Pro, I mean this update terabytes, it's about double the speed of the internal Apple SSD and it a great savings too. So they add additional capability via flash. The Excelsior Forum 2 really steps up this, you know, whether it's a 2019 Mac Pro or even a 2010 to 2010, 2010 to 2012 Silver Tower as well as a PC or you can put this into a Thunderbolt chassis. Plug and play, uses soft rate again, you know, for monitoring and for rate capabilities. This is actually some speeds of the units running right now. I can get another test going, I bet I can. Very, very, very fast. And that's with actual, uh, that's an actual Aja test, I mean, doing a video uh, you know, simulation. So that's not just a, a, a basic you know, benchmark or transfer. I mean, that's using the real stuff that folks use. And it does that performance end to end, which is honestly, Really amazing how far technology has come today, and so that is our forum too for the I say for the Mac Pro 2019. The other big thing for the 2019, really really excited that the offering is memory. You know, the new 2019 go up to one and a half terabytes, 1.5 terabytes of memory. That's 1,500 gigabytes, which is crazy. Now we've got kits to start from as low as 32 gigabytes all the way on up, but again with the great savings you know, versus the factory. And it, again, it's something that, it, that you can do anytime you need to do. Buy what you need, and then you can upgrade as you need. And we're really excited to have certified memory for the Mac Pro. And you know, we have these systems in house. You know, like everything else, I mean, it's built right, tested right. You know, for over 30 years, I mean, we've been upgrading Macs, and it's exciting to have added the Mac Pro 2019, you know, to that list with memory again, up to an amazing whopping 1.5 terabytes. By comparison, the next highest machine that you can upgrade is an iMac Pro. Apple supports up to 256 gigabytes in that machine, so that's one sixth what this guy can take. But well, when you go to OWC, we can put up to 512 in your iMac Pro. You know that would be the other thing I'd love talking about. Any place and everywhere, you know, we're about maximizing your technology. You know where Apple stops, you know we keep on going. Technology keeps moving forward. You know we still support upgrades. You know for the Mac for the Mac Pros from a decade ago, you know the MacBook Pros. You know, Mac Minis, iMacs, I mean, it's not just about all the things that are brand new from Apple. It's also making sure that what you have, the technology that already is serving you, can be kept up to date kept and keeps on cranking. I mean, we enjoy bringing out, you know, the latest and greatest to make, you know, what was the latest and greatest, you know, great again. So you see memory upgrades, solid-state drives, external drives, 
Now this is this is our new Thunderbolt 3 drive, up to two terabytes, super super fast. This is our Envoy Pro EX, and here's a, this is a great example of a drive that works incredibly well with the latest technology. This is USB Type C. It's up to a thousand megabytes a second. It's incredibly rugged. This has been run over trucks, cars. You know, it's been tossed in the water. It's waterproof up to two meters, dust proof. This product goes up to two terabytes in about a thousand megabytes a second on the latest Macs. But a Mac from 2012, this plugs and plays via your USB 3 port and you get a whopping 500 megs a second. That's uh, a good cross section of what we have at NAMM 2020. You know, things that make your workflow better, things that make your computer faster. I'm Larry O'Connor with OWC at NAMM 2020.